Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm sorry I missed the last meeting because I missed all the fun and games. But, <laughs> but it occurred to me, we, the planning board has a budget. They control their spending. If they want a town planner and they need a town planner, they have the right to do it. The other thing that I realized while I was watching on TV is, you know, there's a statute of limitations on civil actions. The Constitution is interpreted differently depending on who controls the court or who's a sitting judge. So if you were living in the area of 97, 98, and 2000, and you question this, you should have, the obvious step was to go bring a civil suit and get a ruling. You know, I mean, we, we seem to be wasting a lot of time, that's all. I, you know, as far as RPC supplying a temporary planner, RC, RPC represents 26 towns. They work with Hampton on certain issues. Climate change is a big issue. They're doing the traffic study for 101 with the town, and they just had the Medi study, so. Lots of things, you, you, you have a big need for a planner and you get a lot of fun. A lot of land in Hampton, if you own ha if you own land and it's wetlands, you're gonna to wanna to turn it into money. So it's up to the planning board to set the, set the rules of what you can build and what you can do. And we rely greatly on the Conservation Commission and I can't stress how much help they are to us. Um, they're oh. also volunteers, there's one I believe there's one paid staff member, um, but they come out, uh, we, we meet monthly, we do site walks, I mean, there's a lot more to what we do than what yeah. you see on TV for that hour and a half or two hours. Oh yeah, you weren't just like that. <coughs>